What's up, you guys? This is Mary with High Priestess Intuition. Um, welcome, my current subscribers, and welcome, 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 newbies. Sorry, I'm in a coat on the 4th of July, but my gosh, it's freezing in my house. So, a little cold. Um, but welcome, my current subscribers, and welcome, 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 newbies. If you enjoyed my content, if you can ring a little bell and follow my soul trap, I super, super appreciate it, you guys. This is a, um energy check. So, it's for all signs, general energy check. <coughs> Excuse me. It's supposed to resonate 24 to 72 hours out from the time that you view it. However, everyone is on different time and life paths. So just throwing that out there. It could very well resonate outside of the three-day range um, for some of you. Um, like I said, it's for all signs. So you have to take the uh, messages that only resonate with you. Um, don't forget the basics. Time is fluid. Energy is fluid. If it doesn't apply, let it fly. And everyone has free will. So throwing that out there. Okay. Oh, and by the way, real quick, happy 4th of July for you guys, especially everyone that lives in the United States of America. Happy 4th. Let freedom ring, just saying. Okay. If I hear or see anything, I'll let you know. I already got a couple messages in this morning. That's why I came in here and, and decided to do one. Uh, my kids are at their dad's right now. Um, they left for the summer to go to their dad's. Um, so it's just me um, and some off days. So I figured I'd come in here and... Um, do some messages for you guys I got already like I said I already got some in so um okay the first message was a Virgo is going to start experiencing a lot of work difficulties and difficulties in their personal life for how that resonates a Virgo is about to start experiencing a lot of work difficulties and difficulties in their personal life how that resonates. Okay, this one just came in just now. And I'm assuming it's with the Virgo. Um, they tried to use heavy manipulation for a relationship, but it did not work. And now people are backing away. He, uh, they try to use heavy manipulation for a relationship but it didn't work now people are backing away and now this person is pissed so they're going to try and get this person fired so now the Virgo I guess is pissed because people aren't doing what they want this person to do to try to manipulate this other person um, and now the Virgo is going to try to get I guess the person they want to be in a relationship with fired well that's just super wrong but it's not going to work, is what I just heard, but it's not going to work. Okay, so it's not going to work. Thank God. That's awful. That is awful. That's horrible, actually. Trying to cover up past mistakes is what I just heard. Trying to cover up past mistakes. So they're trying to cover up past mistakes with a relationship, but the other person's not interested. Move on. Um, but you're trying to cover up past mistakes. So, but I don't know why it's so important to be in a relationship with one specific person. I mean, I don't know what kind of mistakes you're trying to cover up there, but that's pretty cray cray. Let's see if I hear anything else. It's not going to work. Okay, that's so the second time I've heard that. Okay, so it's not going to work. Okay, well, apparently that's the important message in all that is it's not going to work. Okay. So, for whoever that resonates with. Okay. Also, um, another one just came in. Um, a Scorpio is going to end up getting caught... By people they le uh, this person least expected, a Scorpio is going to end up getting caught by people they least expected, or this person least expected. That's what I heard. Um, Virgo and Libra is what I just heard. Virgo and Libra. So for how that resonates for folks, a Scorpio is going to end up getting caught by people this person least expected. Oh, it's so bright in here. Um, and I heard Virgo and Libra. How that resonates. Um, and I guess that's confirmation because my kitty's back there meowing like crazy. So for how that resonates for folks. 
Okay. All right, we got winter solstice reflection is the first one I got out, and then I shuffled out another one, spring equinox rebirth. No on the rebirth is what I just heard. No on the rebirth. Okay. Yeah. Okay. We'll try again. Hope everybody's doing okay today. For real, for real. I really, really do. Okay, and this message just came in too, which is very appropriate for the 4th of July, especially us Americans, you know, that live here in America. Um, I heard, let freedom ring. That's pretty awesome, let freedom ring. Well, yeah, let freedom ring, you guys. You know, the 4th of July was, anybody knows me personally, um, the 4th of July was my dad's favorite holiday, hands down. He was an army vet, and um, it was his favorite holiday. Um, hands down, it really was. And I've always had a special affinity in my heart for the 4th of July uh, because of him. And his um, love of life and liberty and the pursuit of happiness, um, he, you, could, he, you could just feel it exuding from him. Um, and I've always loved the 4th of July because of that. So, just a little tidbit, just saying. Okay. Come on, strike, come on, baby. Come on, come on, strike. Come on. Okay, this one just literally came in too. My goodness, I didn't got cards out yet. Okay, this one just literally came in too. I heard right to vote and voter registration card. So for however that resonates for folks, um, and I guess that's very appropriate on the 4th of July, right to vote and voter registration card. Someone's trying to take away someone's right to vote? That's what I just heard at the end. Someone's trying to take away someone's right to vote? You can't do that. What the crap? You can't do that. I mean, the only way you can take away someone's right to vote, I mean, is if they take away their right to vote, is if they get convicted of something horrible and, um, you know, like a, a crime, and they end up in um, prison or something. Um, but I heard... Um, the let freedom ring, right to vote, voter registration card, and someone's trying to take away someone's right to vote. That's horrible. I mean, I don't know how you would do that. That's, I mean, like I said, you can't unless someone puts himself there, um, like in prison or something like that. But if anybody's, uh, okay, so I heard right to vote and voter registration card, though, before all that. So maybe someone needs information. Maybe you need to see a voter registration card. If you are interested in going to sign yourself up to vote, please, I encourage everyone to do that. Please exercise your right to vote. Please, 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 please. That is one of our natural rights, as especially as citizens of the United States of America. Um, and so many people don't use it. They don't. Um, but if you're interested, um, you ha I mean, you all you have to do is go to a public place. I will not any public place but like the DMV or somewhere of that nature they will ask you you know do you want to sign up um, if you haven't already but um, once you get and this one's kind of this was actually really old really really old for me because um, last time I voted out didn't live here in the place I live now but um, it looks similar to this and let me put out my address I don't want everybody on Facebook seeing my address. It looks similar to this. It's just like a little post-it note-ish. And this one's really, really, really old. Okay? See? And then it'll just tell you on the back. Of course, I live in the state of Alabama. So, see? It'll tell you all the information on the back. See my little state of Alabama voter information card. And it'll tell you what you need to do. Okay? That's all you got to do. It's, it's not too. It's not too hard, okay. But I encourage everyone to get out there and vote and exercise your citizen-like duty. And please, 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 please vote, okay. No matter what, who you vote for, please, 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 okay. Okay. 
Okay, this one just literally just came in too, um, just now. Um, oh my God, she just won't shut up. Oh my God, that one literally just came in, literally just now. Oh my God, she just won't shut up. For however that resonates for folks. Um, I don't know, that one just came in. I'm assuming that has nothing to do with the voter registration and, and all that mess. Um, at least, God, I hope not. Um, but the thing is, is, oh, my gosh, she just won't shut up. You know, but, you know, we live in the United States of America. People don't shut up. That's just the reality. And um, that's kind of what makes our country so great is the difference of opinions and to be able to express yourself. So if anybody has that kind of, where are the rest of my cards? If anyone has that kind of attitude about that, that's pretty sad because you're living in the wrong country if you're trying to, if you're wishing somebody will shut up. Because that's just the nature of our country. Being able to express our opinions and um, live life the way they w we want to live. So, just throwing that out there. Um, oh, here they are. My T-Rex stamps. Y'all see those? Aren't those cool? Alright. We're going to get started. Sorry for the delay. Oh, where's my other card? Oh, okay. Shuffle it out. Okay. Well, I heard shuffle it out again, but I found. No, I didn't. Oh, okay. I heard shuffle it out again. I didn't find it. Okay. We'll get started. All right. Spirit, what messages do you have for reflection? And reflection is basically looking back on um, choices you have made in the past, looking back on your life so far. Um, looking back on past events, it could resonate a million different ways for a million different people. Um, so for how that resonates for folks. Those came out. Spirit, what messages do you have for um, reflection? Okay, this one just literally just came in just now. Uh, that Virgo is really, really coming in strong today. Holy moly. Uh, for who this resonates with. Um, the message that came in was, the Virgo is going to end up digging themselves a big grave. The Virgo is going to end up digging themselves a big grave for who that resonates with. That Virgo is coming in strong today. So, for who that resonates with. Okay. All right, so we have bridge successfully overcoming a problem. Dagger, fear, worries, and tense situations. January, so something either happened in January 2020 or will happen in January 2021. Younger man, dealings or relationships with a younger man. And woman, dealings or relationships with a woman. For who that resonates with. Okay, this one just came in too, just literally just now. Um, so I heard someone's been drinking a lot. Drinking, drug problems, and trying to control sexual addictions. Drinking, drug problems, and trying to control sexual addictions. For who that resonates with. Okay, and then, and then I just heard uh, Libra and Leo. Libra and Leo, for who that resonates with. Um, so apparently a Libra and a Leo... Or maybe a Libra with Leo in their chart, or a Leo with, um, well, Leo with Libra in their chart, um, is having um, serious um, alcohol problems, drug problems, and trying to control sexual addictions. Um, for how that resonates for folks. Um, of course, you know, it can resonate separate different ways for separate different people. It could be a um, 
Libra was uh, Libra in the Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, North Node, Midhaven, or um, uh, Jupiter charts. Same for Leo. Um, how that resonates. Okay. All right. So we're back. I like to say reflections, looking back on choices you've made, um, the life you've lived so far. Um, hopefully reflecting back and wanting to change it to make it better for yourself or in your family if you have one. Um, but we have bridge successfully overcoming a problem. So you're going to successfully overcome a problem. But you have fear, worries, and tense situations to deal with, I guess, before you um, overcome the problem is how I'm taking that. Um, because something happened in January of 2020 or will happen in January 2021. Something happened in January 2020 is what I just heard. Something happened in January 2020. And you knew you should have taken action then and you didn't is what I just heard. And you knew you should have taken action then and you didn't for however that resonates for folks. Okay. Um, dealings and relationships with a younger man. So you're dealing with a younger man. And dealings and relationships with a woman. I just heard legal on this one. So whoever this resonates with, I'm assuming it's some kind of legal issues or something like that. Okay. Okay. I heard, uh, do it again because I've lost my card. I don't know why in the world it went. Let's see. All right, this one literally just came in just now. A series of events is going to spur some action for, um, that people, a uh, uh, series, okay, hold on, let me stop. A series of events is going to spur someone and some people. I heard someone and some people to take some action for however that resonates. A series of events is going to spur someone and some people to take some action. So for however that resonates. That's very broad, but um, that's what I heard. So... They realize now the heavy manipulation in the past is what I just heard. They realize now the heavy manipulation in the past for how that resonates for folks. Okay. Oh, we got it back. Yay. Automobile Equinox release. Okay. Well, there we go. And I got this one yesterday, so. Okay. I think that's the one I had, I think. All right. Spirit, what messages do you have for the collective? Okay, this one just literally just came in too. The messengers are coming in so heavy today. I mean, they were coming in, they were coming in before I turned the camera on. And usually when that happens, um, you know, they do come in heavy. I heard four. This one plus four. One, two, three. Oh, okay. So four. Um, the message was, um, those that were jealous of you in the past, are going to start getting some heavy karma. Those that were jealous of you in the past are going to start getting some heavy karma for however that resonates. So I guess there were people that were jealous of you in the past. Yes. Okay, so yes, which I already knew that, but it's very confirmed. So there were people that were jealous of you in the past, but they're going to start experiencing heavy karma. They didn't help when they should have and made poor choices is what I just heard. They didn't help when they should have and made poor choices for whoever that resonates with. Okay. Okay. So, um, release. We we all know what release means. Letting go. Um, letting go and letting God. If you believe in God and um, if you believe, you know, in God. Um, but letting go. Okay. Broken bridge, unsuccessful outcome to a problem.
You can't fix, I, I heard, I'm sorry, I heard, you just can't fix some people, is what I heard. You just can't fix some people for how that resonates. Boat, money, or property through an inheritance, winning, or windfall. Chain, chain of events that will affect your life. And, you know, I heard from Spirit just a minute ago about the, um, you know, spurring of events that are going to cause uh, someone and some people to take some action. So maybe that's that that for some people, may, uh, maybe not, but it's kind of ironic that that just comes in. And Moon, it changes your life. In Target, a goal-oriented person. Okay, so like I said, releases let, like letting go and letting God, if you believe in God, um, you know, for some. Um, but letting go, you know, letting go and moving on. So um, an unsuccessful outcome to a problem, I heard you just can't change some people, is what I heard. Um, and then, but for whoever this resonates with, you're going to um, inherit, it looks like you're going to, well, not necessarily an inheritance. It says a money or you're going to receive a money or property through an inheritance winning or a windfall so it could for some it could be an inheritance some it could be a winning and some just a windfall but it looks like it's going to be a money or property both for some both for some okay it's what that's why i just heard both for some and then chain a chain of events that will affect your life. And I heard from Spirit, you know, a chain of events is going to spur someone and some people to t start taking some action. So I strongly think it's, for those of you that it resonates with, I, I think that's this. that Because, you, know, you know, I just heard it just a, little, a minute ago. And then it's going to change your life. Absolutely. In a very positive way. Okay. And then target, so you're a goal-oriented person. Going to make a lot of positive life changes is what I just heard. Going to make a lot of positive life changes. Well, that's amazing, you guys. That's amazing. That's what I'm talking about for sure, for sure, for sure. Yes. Okay. Okay, 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 okay. That's what I'm talking about. Okay. Okay, I just heard get a couple kippers. I was about to close it. I'm already at 22 minutes, but I heard get a couple kippers, so I will. Okay. Put these to the side. Got them all buried up over here. And I think it was very appropriate about the voter registration and all that coming in on the 4th of July. I, you know, and it was nice for me to be able to share the information on the voter information. I mean, because, you know, I don't think people get to hear that enough, you know. Um, or maybe they just don't have the information on where they need to go. I know for sure the DMV will give you, give you the information for sure. I know other public places do too. I've been asked at other public places as well before in my life. But I know for sure the DMV does. For sure, for sure, for sure. And anybody who doesn't know what the DMV is, it's the Department of Motor Vehicles. It's where you go to uh, do, take your driver's test, get your... Um, um, uh, your driver's license to get it renewed, you know, that kind of thing. Do with your license, driver's license. Spirit, what messages do you have for the collective? Unexpected income upgrade. I did not hear reversed. Let me wait and see. Immature woman. No, I have not heard reverse. Okay. All right. Unexpected income upright. Immature woman. All right. Let me. Um. I feel the need to clarify with the. Kipper. I heard baby. Baby. Okay, so I'll do baby Kipper. And then we'll close it. All 
All right, Spirit, what messages you have for the collective for unexpected income? Main person, upright. Good lady, upright. And great happiness reverse. So for whoever this resonates with, someone is receiving unexpected income, but that looks like um, someone's main, uh, main female, like their wife, Yes, yes, I just heard yes. So someone's wife is not happy that someone else is receiving unexpected income. So maybe someone has like a mistress or a side chick or a, a something like that on the side. Yes, yes, okay. So someone's got a side person on the side and they're giving them money. Um, and the wife's not happy. Okay. And then mature woman upright. Spirit, what messages do you have for mature woman upright? I don't understand that. Why don't you just get a divorce? I mean, come on now. Just get a divorce. And then next time, just get a prenup. That way you're not having all these kind of problems. I mean, my Lord. Making things so much more complicated than they have to be. Alright, um, clarifying mature woman upright is marriage card. A journey reversed. And hope big water. Reversed. So for who this resonates with, there's a mature woman out there that looks like is um, either married or um, about to get married, but they, they're not traveling but and losing, and I heard losing hope, and they're losing hope. Not for long is what I just heard. Not for long. Okay, so they were losing hope, but they're, but it's not going to be for long, apparently. Chain of events is what I just heard. Chain of events. So maybe um, this chain of events, um, you know, I heard from Spirit, a chain of events are, go are going to occur that's going to spur someone and some people to start taking some action. And then we got it again down here in the release card. So maybe um, this mature woman has something to do with this this energy field down here because I heard not for long. I heard um, they didn't have hope for, um, they didn't have hope, but it's not going to be for long because of chain of events. So apparently somebody really needs to hear that. So for whoever that resonates with. Let me see if I hear anything else. Okay, this one just literally just came in. A visit from people that you don't see very often. A visit from people that you don't see very often is going to bring extreme enlightenment. They are going to discover something you would have never expected. So for how that resonates for folks... A visit from people that you don't see very often is going to bring extreme enlightenment. Um, they're going to discover something that you never expected. For however that resonates for folks. That one just literally just came in. All right, you guys. We're done, 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 done. Um, two for 30s and um, personal readings. Please email or Facebook message me first. Don't message me. I mean, don't send me the money first on PayPal. You got to um, contact me first so we can make sure we are completely clear on what I need to do and what you want and all that before we do it okay um and um and then after that we'll do the payment arrangements um it's currently a 72 hour turnaround for those by the way um for any personal readings or the um two for 30s just let you know um 
it, but donations you can do anytime, any time of the day, month, week, year, whatever. Um, yeah, I'll ask you to do it through my PayPal, which is High Priestess Tarot Five. Um, all you got to do is just go to my PayPal link and click on donation, and then at the very bottom, there's a drop down on the bottom, cleared out, and put in donation. That way, everyone can be on the same page for tax purposes. I'd super appreciate it. All right, you guys. Well, I will see you guys later, and namaste.